We are just one week away from the city of Utica adopting their new budget. And with that, of course, comes that 2% tax decrease. But what does it mean? And what was the thought process in putting the money there and not into another need? Jen Seelig caught up with Mayor Ron Palmieri to find out. I think at any point that you have a decrease uh, in, in your taxes is something that it shows you that the city is working extremely well. For this upcoming fiscal year, after a 7 to 1 vote, the city budget was adopted. That including a 2% tax decrease for city residents. And I think a 7 to 1 vote reflects the fact that there's a lot of confidence in the direction that the city's in and the, the fact that we have great communication not only with the members of the Common Council, but we have it with the Comptroller's Office and other elected officials throughout the state. Last year, the city sold two big properties, which significantly increased city revenue while it was eliminating the cost of maintaining these buildings. One of them being the former General Electric building here on Bleecker Street and also the Utica Marina. Now, since these two properties are sold, the mayor has the opportunity to decrease taxes. And I do feel at this point that you share that wealth with the residents. Uh, and I think that they uh, deserve it because we had a very good year and much rather than putting that back in to either fund balance or another area, I think all the residents deserve to share the 2% discount this year. The decrease will not go into effect until April 1st. I thought this was a very smooth transition and it, it just goes hand in hand with the people letting them know that uh, the city's working for them, members of the Common Council working very well with the administration and the Comptroller's Office. So it, it's a good thing. The city's moving in the right direction, and we certainly want to continue that. Reporting, Jen Seelig, Eyewitness News.